But you got your rhythm going now. <laughs> it's a make or miss lead. All right, make nylon. Steph and D'Angelo Russell combined for 56 points last night and a whole lot of swishes. Nick, <laughs> do we start keeping swish stats? And if we did, who would lead the league in swishes? I'm going with Steph yeah. because he's Steph. But, yeah, we got to find out who has the wettest jumper in the league. I'm willing to I bet. Mean, as long as it goes in. I mean, no, nah, we need Swiss. purity. See, I was a back rim shooter. <laughs> I mean, my just was like right off back rim. As long as it goes in. I think Switch doesn't make you a better shooter. What? No, as long, as if long you're as so it accurate in. that it never touches anything. Like I feel like that's like the highest level of shooting, right? <laughs> I, I mean, as a kid, I was taught to aim at back rim. I was a back rim shooter. It still went in. <laughs> Hey, if it goes in, it goes in. <laughs> but if it goes in without touching anything, that's pretty cool, too. Miss common sense. I don't care what the screen says. The Wizards have take your dog to work day. Paul, do you ever take your dogs to <laughs> Listen, work? I got four dogs, and yeah. I've never taken that one to work. That's common sense right there. I mean, I, I, Nick, I have you ever taken your dogs to work? No, no, I'm allergic, too. So <laughs> I, I'm all for the, uh, the keep your space dogs. at home. <laughs> I just, this is, I, I guess this is what you got to do when you're going to win about 25 games. <laughs> hey, I'm just saying. No? Well, look at everyone. Oh, you guys are all dog lovers. <laughs> Excuse it's like me. A, it's like a minor league baseball promotion. <laughs> it Make is what it is. Support. Dario Sarge hits the deck, and now watch all four Suns players yeah. rush to his rescue. Nick, yes. does this at all change your opinion on the Suns? No, they're still terrible, but <laughs> uh, Monty, Monty Williams is trying to push that culture. Good for him. This is w the type of highlight you see, guys. Yeah. When you're trying to change a culture and guys are buying in early, good for them, but they're still going to be bad. Yeah. I mean, we know they're going to be bad, but they're building something. They got a nice young core over there. I, they're going to be fun to watch. It's easy to do it in October. <laughs> when, you're, when you're 30 games yeah. under 500, it's a little harder to run over. Yeah, 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 <laughs> Miss fun. positions. Watch Steven Adams grab the rebound, go coast to coast for the M1 layup. Paul, Ooh, he's like, this no, a... Russ, this is all me. Yeah. <laughs> I've been waiting saw, to do this, we right? We saw Russ do this time and time again. He's like, this is my time to shine. I'm all for it. Whatever it <laughs> takes to get the ball in his hands more going coast to coast. I'm like, Paul's right. He's looked at Westbrook so many times like, I want the ball. I, I can try. I'm just saying, so in, in two preseason games, we've seen him go coast to coast and lay it up, and then we've seen him hit threes. Like he's maybe he's going to hop. game is going to open up. Oh, oh, look. oh. <laughs> I'm excited about this game. Look, his game is going to open up. Me, I mean, look, he's going to be like, I'm going to be an all-star now. <laughs> it's going to the end. All right, <laughs> man. Poor <laughs> man. Bobon took the Instagram to rebel against small blankets. Said Bobon, quote, blankets are too small. Not anymore. Meet Big Blanket Company. I'm excited to be a partner in this amazing company. Nick, are you worried the company will run out of fabric, and are you worried about the initials of that company? No. <laughs> That's a better uh, question. But no, oh I'm, I'm for anything Bobon wants to get into. He's underpaid. I think more companies should get into business with him because it seems like he is he is the fun guy of the NBA. He actually I mean, is. Everybody kind of loves him. Bed are you going to put that on? <laughs> a bobon bed. A, a oh, yeah, bobon bed yeah. is probably one of a kind. It just reminds me of like Freedman's in Atlanta. You're like they they had the market cornered on shoes, big shoes or yeah, whatever. But He's got the and, market cornered on Everybody's not this guy's size. <laughs> I mean, come on. 7'6". Seven, seven, a regular leg is like a napkin for him. The Mystics. <laughs> The Mystics oh, hosted man. the Sun for the decisive game five of the WNBA Finals last night. Despite falling down by nine in the third quarter, Della Don dropped 21 and nine and let a comeback for the Mystics' first oh. WNBA title in franchise history. After the game, we learned the severity of the injury she was playing through. Check it out. Elena not only has one herniated disc, she has three. <laughs> and when you're talking about... The medical staff is going to kill you right oh, now. Oh, I don't but. care. But when you're talking about... But it, it's, it's so important because when you're talking about playing for the players to the left and to the right of you and being a leader on this team and being one of the captains and pushing through to win us the championship, I mean, that's a huge testament to both her and Ariel in this last series. So, again, thank you, Della. <laughs> Love you, Tash. Yeah. Three of them things. <laughs> Three of them. I got so much heat the other day because I said, when they asked me what they're going to do, I said, they're going to shoot her up. I said, no, you can't do that. And da, da, da. And, you know, three herniated discs. You think she played through that just raw? Uh, Nick, what's your reaction <laughs> to hearing that Della Don played through three of them things, as Natasha said? It's awesome. In, in my mind, nobody is Diana Taurasi, but she is Elena Della Don, is this era's uh, 
athlete who has proven that she has taken her game to a whole different level. Mm -hmm. When you play through that kind of pain and Ooh. still deliver on the biggest stage, you deserve any and all praise that comes your way. I mean, I don't know what it feels like to have a herniated disc, let alone three of them. Uh, but the play, I mean, I had a sore back and that was tough to play on. I mean, I, I played, everybody asked me why I was in the wheelchair. I played on a torn ACL in the finals. I mean, you know, but three herniated discs. <laughs> I'm just kidding, by the way. I, 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 I was like, Paul said, we weren't on camera. Paul told me, look at him like. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody asked me why. Of course, I had a torn ACL in the finals. Now, now what? Play through it. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports analysis and highlights, download the ESPN app. And for live streaming and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.